Attention ladies and gentlemen, the film you are about to see contains numerous examples of exposed male flesh. If you are a woman or a man of a nervous deposition, please vacate the auditorium at the earliest possible convenience. Because of the exposed flesh, this film has been certificated the frightful P for pornography. Enjoy. Association Football, a two-minute instructional film. Football was invented by the British, as was anything that is any good, such as the moving picture cinema -orium, the automatic motor carriage, the piano, and basically everything except baseball, which is a horrid, frightful sport, seemingly derived from the female-orientated exercise rounders. Association football is played by real men, except on Gay Cho's Day. Association football is partaken by gentlemen with complicated rules like the offside rule. Excuse me, sir. Could you explain to me the offside rule? Boy, well, it's simple. It's simple to be looks. All you have to do is behind the toe, the defender behind the last toe be tall, they don't, is offside. Time it looks simple, I've got his chippy. Football is a working class game, enjoyed by the working classes, and as such should only be watched in the right apparatus. Scarf, this will cover your mouth to stop your breathing in frightful working class diseases, like typhoid in the three day week. Rosette, this informs other people of which team you support and also X is a good prop to use when meeting your employer in the street to avoid embarrassment. Oh good gracious Simpkins, go to the old footy ball. No, I have just won a dog show. Oh good, um, where's the dog? Football is a man's game. Players play on for the pain barrier. Excuse me good sir, it appears that that leg needs some medical attention. God blimey no governor, I'm going too hard for that, I'm not playing all the 60 games this season, time for ducks! Football games are umpired by policemen, meaning that the crime rate in working class towns increases between 3pm and 5pm on Saturday afternoons. Football is a game played by sportsmen in the age old English tradition. Penalty kick! I'm not going to stand there in front of that ball and stop a English win from scoring. I'm going to move out the way. I'm not going to. I refuse to score in a nasty, cheating, foreign way by arbitrarily score. I refuse. England has the best football team in the world. That is a fact. Despite the fact we have not participated in any international competition, and all English players play by the letter of the law. The only players set down are dirty cheating foreigners. Both. That was a kick. Put that was never a flower. Do you expect me to take the word of an extent of a dirty cheating foreigner of a, an eccentric English nice gent? Then you're much mistaken. Get off the field. You will pay for this. Ten days later, Hitler invaded Poland. Coincidence. We think not. All footballers work in curl mines and play for the honor of the game as opposed to the great bags of money their European counterparts get. But are they downhearted? No! no! Football! Truly a game of two halves. The game that even Hitler couldn't stop. Due to the outbreak of war, all football games have been cancelled. As appointed by the War Office.